Good morning. Good morning. You're going to meet Autumn Mason in a second if you haven't. It's a treat. The first time Autumn walked into my class it was a 1301 class, and she said, right up front. Now, I'm going to tell you a secret. The first day of class, we try very hard to set a tone for the rest of the year. We have syllabus, deadlines, tests, all of the sorts of things that we try to bring gravity to the situation. It's very, very hard to do with the girl in the front row smiling at you the entire time. She's doing it right now, isn't she? You're going to see this. She did that all semester, by the way. Autumn's going to graduate, last I checked, with a 3.93 GPA. <laughs> and yes, I have to my application before I said that. But when I wrote her and said, what are you most proud of? College of the Mainland. The GPA didn't even enter into it. She said three things. She said she was most proud of her time at Phi Theta Kappa. She was most proud of her outreach that she had done as part of College of Maine. And she was most proud of being the mascot. If you've seen an event with Comet the Duck, you've met all. <laughs> Autumn is proud of being from Com. And those three things that I just mentioned all have one thing in common, service. Service to College of the Mainland, service to the community. <laughs> She's proud to be from Com, and ladies and gentlemen, we are proud that she is as well. Ladies and gentlemen, Autumn Mason. better your education, and today is proof that you have successfully completed your goal. In many of your lives, you have been knocked down time and time again, but every time you were knocked to the ground, you rose back up. And look at you now in your black robes, which usually, if you're in a robe at 10 in the morning, it means you have given up. But you push forward when others have given up. You refused to quit, and these obstacles gave you strength. You chose to hear the positive comments and the things that you chose to hear and the things that you told yourself fed your faith and your doubts eventually drown. Now these challenges do not end today as we leave the auditorium, but neither should our memories and gratitude. The gift of education is priceless and something that can never be taken away. Each one of you had to ask who you wanted to be. I always thought, when I grow up, I want to be famous. I want to be a star. I want to be in movies. When I grow up, I want to see the world, drive a nice car, I want to have groupies, to quote the pussy casuals. <laughs> but seriously, we all had to figure out what makes us happy. No matter how crazy it may have sounded to everyone else, you knew that attending College of Mainland was the right path for you. So now that y'all know, I am College of the Mainland's mascot, Comet the Fighting Duck. 
I decided that I was going to try something new in a different environment, and so did many of you by choosing to go to the school. The worst that could happen would be the word no or the fear of failing, but that did not stop us. We did not give up. We strive for the next step. We all had the courage to ask questions and to search for answers. I know many of you are beyond ready to receive this piece of paper that proves to the world that you are now fit to join the ranks of a group of elite and powerful men and women. Some of my fellow graduates, this is the next step towards your next learning journey. And some of you have completed your journey and are ready to face the world. Anything is possible in a brand new world, a world that you now inherit, whether you like it or not. The jig is up, the clock has run out, and the future with a capital F now rests with all of you in these giant robes and funny looking hats. I think everyone can agree that we have learned so much from attending College of Maitland. Some things that I have personally learned are responsibility, accountability, time management, that X does not always equal one, and that cramming for tests really does work if you try hard enough. <laughs> not only has College of the Mainland taught us many more great skills and has given us a great education, we have gained pride in ourselves. We can take this to our schools and our community as we encourage others to take the great journey of knowledge. This is our chance to craft our own lives and leave our mark on the world. As today is certainly a day to look back at these years at College of Mainland, it is also a day to look forward. One thing to always remember as we leave is to support each other in the home that we once shared by continually cherishing it by its continual growth. To conclude today, by being College of the Mainland's 2015 graduates shows that we have pride in our school. And now it's time to make College of the Mainland proud of us. Put something positive into the world, do something kind, make somebody laugh, and do not take yourself too seriously. As I finish my journey here today, I would like to take time to remember all the selfies I took as Comet the Fighting Duck. <laughs> I will always treasure hashtag College of the Mainland, hashtag Student Life, and hashtag Comet the Duck. But most important of all, hashtag 2015 graduate. And this is me signing off, Comet the Fighting Duck.